Well, unapproved routes uh, have become escape points for travelers between Ghana's neighbors, Togo and Burkina Faso, after officials responded to the directives to close all borders. Meanwhile, perishable goods entering or leaving the country are being allowed access through the main borders in accordance with the president's directive. All land borders in the Upper East region have been closed as directed. The Ghana-Burkina Faso border at Kulungugu, Monori and the Ghana-Togo border at Pulimakum remained locked. Immigration officials say traders and other travelers arriving in commercial vehicles from Burkina Faso to Ghana ahead of the Boku market on Tuesday were turned away in the early hours of Monday. As a result, travelers resorted to the use of unapproved routes to escape the prying eyes of immigration officers. At the time of our visit, however, trucks loaded with what officials say are perishable goods were being permitted across the Kulungugu border to and from Ghana. Port Health officials lamented over the lack of personal protection equipment to enhance their work and safety. They are also without basic test kits like thermometers for screening. So people come in unless you shout on them to come to Port Health. Because they look at the structure, it doesn't look like the office. The thermometer to which she's talking about, 839, it ceases to work. So the assistance we need from the authorities, we need the structure here, we need PPEs to be able to do the work. Even though the borders are closed, we are working because some Ghanaians will come. You can't say they shouldn't come in. You have to screen them. You see, 39.1. So that's what's happening at the various uh, borders. And we have eyes over there uh, just to ensure that indeed uh, the implementation of the present directive is going as expected.